Hello guys. In this video, we are going to talk about a constructor. So what is constructor? A class consists of five different types of member function. Out of these five different types, we have one very special member function. And this special member function, we call it as a constructor. Why this is called as so special? It is called as so special because of four reasons. The very first, its name is same as that of class name. Second, it does not have any return types. Third, it is called automatically when the object is created. And the last, that its job is to initialize the data members. Let us understand this with a quick example. For this example, we are going to write a class called as a complex. Inside this, we are going to define these two data members, real and imaginary. To initialize these data members, the job to initialize these data members is of this constructor. So this constructor, if you look closely, it is a normal function, but its name is same as that of class name and it does not have any return type and it is initializing the data members and that is why it is called as a special member function. To see what are the values of real and imaginary to display it onto the console, we are going to write this facilitator function. This is again a member function, print data. Now let us come down to the main and let us create an object of this class. The moment we are going to create this object C1, it is automatically going to call this constructor and it is going to initialize my data members. To display the, the uh, to display the values of real and imaginary, I am going to call this function called as print data. Whenever I am going to call this function, it is going to display me whatever the constructor has initialized the value with, the 10 and 20. In next video, we are going to talk about types of constructor. Till then, follow us on all the social platforms and do subscribe our channel. Thank you.